All right, what's up everybody? I'm going to be showing you how to use this upcoming recession that we have to really increase your net worth and to really get rich in a sense. And along with this, take into mind that I'm an 18 year old college student. So the first way and the most obvious way that you can increase your net worth during these times is by investing in stocks, <clears throat> most specifically index funds. Index funds this year are down nearly 20 to 30% from their highs. The S&P 500 was trading at around $4,800. A year from today, it is now currently around $3,900. And famous banks, including JP Morgan and Chase, are predicting that index funds and stocks can drop more than 20%. Along with this, the history of a bear market that rose more than 30% which we had a bear market of 20% last year. In 2009, they had a bear market of 30% and the S&P 500 fell down 50% right after that. So stocks are a great way to increase your net worth during a time of a recession. The next way that you can increase your net worth is through real estate. Now, real estate Right now, the prices are a bit high. They were extremely high, but they have slowly gone down. Housing declines are very rare, in fact. Few times in the last century has housing actually declined. Morgan Stanley actually predicts that in the future, in the upcoming months, we will have a 7% decrease in housing prices. Along with this, Fitch Ratings reports a 10 to 15% decrease in the real estate market. We have seen up to 25% in big parts of the country and with these massive increases, we are about to see slowly and slowly decreases in real estate prices. Another way you can increase your net worth is through cash and Forex trading. The Euro is now officially less powerful than the US dollar. The British pound is also less powerful than the US dollar. That means the US dollar is getting more powerful in value and your money is now worth more. All assets right now are falling in price. All stocks, real estate, crypto, everything is falling in price, in value, that should be certain. Interest percentage are actually beating inflation right now. And along with this, recession hedges are also predicting that Investing in cash right now is the best way that you can invest your money currently. Another way you can increase your net worth is to buy buying more. You should see this as an opportunity of sale. Think of it as a Black Friday in a sense. You're getting more bang for your buck. You're getting more for your money. In the future and in the long term, the market has always gone up. So you should see this as an opportunity to buy more capital and to increase your net worth. Right now, since there's a recession, there's less competition and many companies are playing it safe. That is another reason why you should try to increase your net worth and try to gain more capital during these times in order to buy these certain aspects that I've alluded to before. Another way to get rich, another reason during this session is that after a bear market, there's always a bull market. Once stocks find their extreme low, they will always increase. An example of this is the S&P 500 that I alluded to in 2009. It increased almost 40% at the end of its recession term. You should also see this as a long-term investment and you should always look towards investing in a more aspect of not short-term gains, but more long-term gains. Another, another way is to act early. You never know when you're officially in recession. It takes two consecutive quarters of falling GDP to officially state that we are in a recession. So you should always assume that you're in a recession, especially when you see inflation very high and unemployment very low. To combat this, you should reduce your expenses in order to save more and invest more. Reinvest all the money that you have on the side, especially if you're young and do not have that many dependents. Along with this, you should have a plan if your income drops. You should always save up to six months of your income 
in case you ever get laid off from your job, fired, or something unexpected happens, like you have a health crisis or anything like that. So you really need to act early and act now. There's only about one to two more years until we're officially out of this recession. Thank you and I appreciate your time. Please leave a tip. Please like and subscribe.